Alabama's Kool-Aid McKinstry has been one of the most anticipated cornerbacks in college football for the past few seasons, but has started to slip down draft boards due to it being a competitive class. We'll take a closer look at the player he can be at the next level on this Two Minute Drill. McKinstry is a well-rounded cornerback who moves around the field with extremely smooth feet and nice physicality through the snap. He excels in press coverage, but also is able to bail with excellent fluidity so that he's rarely ever being taken advantage of in coverage. In fact, he was so smooth in coverage, he largely just eliminated his assignment as an option on the play and was rarely targeted all season as a result. McKinstry also has extremely impressive instincts too as a cornerback with excellent processing to read the quarterback and identify his target in order to make him reconsider his pass or close out on the throwing window. McKinstry had his moments of bad tackling, especially versus Texas, but when working downfield, he was noticeably better and was able to routinely limit yardage on the outside as a result. Thanks to McKinstry's comfort level on the outside, he's a natural at turning his hips and working vertically with his assignment and generally does a good job of taking away the sideline and limiting the window of opportunity for the pass. He also does a nice job of using his eyes in the right way in order to read his assignment and not get thrown off on routes. That headiness he possesses will shine through as he ages, but combined with his great athleticism right now, it makes him very dangerous immediately out of the gates. At 6 foot flat and around 190 pounds, he has the size to continue on the outside and great speed to keep up his level of play at the next level. Currently the big problem is he is a bit lighter for a cornerback who plays the sideline more than the football, so you'd like to see him either bulk up or generate more interceptions and turnovers as he develops. For a pro comparison, McKinstry reminds me of AJ Terrell of the Atlanta Falcons. Terrell possesses a similar frame and underappreciated demeanor in his play that has made him one of the most dependable and talented cornerbacks in the NFL. For McKinstry, he has the skills and play IQ to step into a defense and potentially assume the top cornerback position by week one of his first season. For an NFL draft range, it seems Kool-Aid is being pushed back by the other first round cornerbacks in this class, but I think he still has a chance to be one of the first defenders off the board and a top 15 pick in this class. Ultimately, I can't see him getting outside of the top 25 though. There are plenty of talented cornerbacks that'll be available this April and they'll come in all different styles for whatever your taste is. But for me, I'm sticking with the good old-fashioned Kool-Aid. And that's the two-minute drill.